it's March now, and the frogs have left their winter semi-hibernation places and laid their frog spawn, or eggs, in my little garden pond. Their clumps of frog spawn can contain well over a thousand eggs sometimes. I'm using time-lapse video now to speed up the next few days showing the development of the little tadpoles. A few days later the young maturing tadpoles begin to wriggle about in their capsule of nutritious egg jelly. The little tadpoles have been developing quite quickly now and are ready to wriggle free of their capsule of egg jelly. Here we see the completely developed little tadpoles swimming freely and are now complete with their feathery gills. It's April the 14th now and we have moved on 16 days now and the tadpoles are growing strongly and as you can see the mouth parts and eyes have also developed well. Here you can see the tadpoles feeding on the green algae which is growing on the stones. Unfortunately the tadpoles have lots of predators who eagerly would like to eat them. So only a handful of the tadpoles will survive into adult frogs. Here we can see a carrion crow that comes to my garden pond most days to feed on the tadpoles which have strayed into the shallow parts of the pond. Also this blackbird comes down to the pond to feed on the unfortunate tadpoles. And I've seen robins, magpies, starlings and other birds that all take their share of the tadpoles from the margin of my pond. Well, as the weeks go by, the tadpoles begin to develop their legs. In this video here, you can see that the tadpole has started to grow its hind legs. After the hind legs have started to form, a pair of front legs will begin to develop and the tail will start to disappear. At this stage you will have noticed that the tadpoles begin to look more like frogs. Well, the time has come now, perhaps in the next week or two, for the little froglets to leave the pond and become land-breathing amphibians. This little froglet will be released into my garden where in two or three years time with a little bit of luck it will make its way back to my garden pond where it will continue the life cycle of the frog. Hi there folks. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little video 
showing the life cycle of the frogs from my little garden pond. <laughs> okay folks, bye for now, bye.